lecture is always a big problem for the uh, transition period of international student. Uh, being a tutor, I often and I often hear my fellow students saying, I was sitting in the lecture, but I couldn't understand much. Uh, I think it's important that you prepare the lecture early. Look at, uh, for example, whether there's a couple of chapters in the textbook that you're supposed to read before attending the lecture. That definitely would help. And I think now most of the lecture are uh, have a recording. I have a, a, in Moodle have either uh, can be streamed later on. Listen to that again will always help. Uh, Sometimes it's it's important that you sit in the lecture and write down what lecture says, not just by looking at what's happening on the lecture slide. It's always hard to start with. How uh, I think that then again that. Uh, end up in, uh, in another issue with whether you can engage with other students who are better at English. When I started my university, I made friends with a lot of uh, domestic students. If I didn't get couple uh, understand a couple of words or didn't get what lecture was saying, I always go politely ask my fellow students, say, do you mind me to have a look at your lecture slide, what you have been written down? And then I compare to mine to see what I have been missed out. Uh, normally another, another See, students should do is if they have a break, go ask the lecture. I mean, don't feel shy about asking a question uh, towards the lecture. A lot of international students maybe have a misperception is that if I ask a silly question, then the lecturer would think uh, I'm not a good student. I think that's totally not true. They are there to help you and uh, use their consultation time if you missed something from lectures, go ask them and they'll help you.